All right, guys, you heard me talk about I was going to be showing you something pretty special here. Now, my man Tony, he uses this pack out every day at work. So it goes everywhere, in the truck, out of the truck, in the truck, out of the truck. So with these pack outs, he obviously has all his, his complete setup here, all the stuff he's using throughout the day. And obviously, you're going to run through batteries pretty quick. So what he came up with was a Milwaukee pack out six bay charger. All right, you've seen me talk about this charger. It's, it's awesome, guys. And I think it's only like, this was included, right? This In, in the $199 kit, yes, this is. was a, one of the yeah. free tools that you can pick. Now, I probably wouldn't use it for that. And remember, guys, this is a sequential charger. So it'll charge one. When this one's done, it'll charge the next one. But you got this cool switch that can switch them over. Mm -hmm. you, you know, can skip a battery. Yep, you could yeah. skip any battery you want. It's a really a cool. I would love to see them come out with a rapid charger Absolutely. one of these. You know, the problem they kind of do, but it's only 318 mm -hmm. and it's 312. Wow. And, that, you know, that's just wasted space. But show us. All right, so this is that low profile box. Show us how you so, did this. As you can see, it's pretty much in there, pretty secure. It holds its own weight. So what I did was, if you see. Oh, so it can come in and out. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Um, so it's really no fabrication to the charger itself. It's just right. the pack out. So if you see the side of these chargers, they have these tabs. Right. And all I did was just cut a little notch for it. Would you use a multi-tool? Yeah. Just throw that in there. Oh, wow. Yeah, I can see it right here. Yeah, pull it back out. But, I mean, wow. It, it's weird how it just locks it in there. So, you know. That is a great idea. Yeah, hold it upside down. Remember you were telling me? I mean, like, really, you can tell that it's yes. in there. It's, it's not, it's it's not, not going to go. Out. It'll go in and out of the truck, no problem. Yeah. See, Milwaukee's going to see. See, why did, this is what Milwaukee needs to come out with, Absolutely. this kind of stuff. They need to make everything pack out. If yes. you're going to commit to something, yep. you have to now transform a charger to pack out. You've got to yep. do everything pack out at this point. And people are eating them up, so. Oh, yeah. They can't, you know, that's the one thing we're talking about is, you know, because there's a lot in some of the stores by me mm -hmm. still. Are they going to, because I'll tell you, if they drop 20 bucks, people are going to buy second, third sets of them. It, yeah. it, it's well, that now popular. Now they're starting to jump back up again. They're, they're raising the price. Oh, they are? 199 Yeah, they're going back up to the 270 mark. So you know what would be great for you too? And I'm gonna, next time I'm going to bring one for you. I, you, know, you ever see that video with that uh, Rumor Price. Industry? No. Rumor Industries makes a battery mm -hmm. holder. It's, this guy so fabricates it. Yes, I got oh, it. Um, I got it. Oh, that's perfect. I haven't done the video yet. I was going to buy the other one, the red metal ones that you had. Um, yeah, that's the Rumor Industry oh, yes, ones. The yes. ones I have on my um, trailer. Yes. I was going to get those. I got it hooked on the large box right here. And you can put all, so, you know. I'll show you like how I have it pretty much all set up. So This is a great idea here for the pack out. So what I do is... Because the big box has the handle. Yep. That's mostly the hand tools. So I have all the hand tools. Oh, in there. nice. Yeah. Oh, you got that hyper tough set. Yeah. Hyper tough set. Throw that in there. How's the hyper tough set working? Not bad, right? Yeah, I mean, it gets the job done. It's just no, the job uh, done. And then the next set. They got the Huskies down to $19.99. That's all my batteries. Oh, so you did. The insert. This is because this is what came with the international tool. Right. The insert. Did so you get this idea for me with the bat? With this? Yes, I yes. Did the one that you mounted. Yep. Wow. And you fit one, two, three, four. I mean, you four, got a lot of power there. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve batteries. Nine 18 volt batteries and three 12. Gotta remember, guys, this is a, a great setup. You know, when you saw mine, I had all the big boys in there and I take up a lot of space. With the fives, you could have probably gotten four, four, four. So oh, what yeah. is that? Oh, no, 12. Yeah. And Easy. even if you went with twos or whatever Oh, twos, you use. forget it. Twos, you could fit 16 of them right. here. It, it's. Pretty much this is what I, like, grinders and stuff like that. This yep. would be for my circular saw, recip, you know, impact, uh, drywall gun, screw gun. Where'd you get these two weights? Those were... International tool? Again, international tool. You know, the 8 and the 12. I still even had... So you used one like Just I did. one. That's yes. I... That's smart. You know, I haven't even opened the 8 yet. I gotta actually do I that video. I think the 8's by far the, the best battery. The best battery. It is, guys. I'm uh, telling you. I'm... I'm actually getting longer runtime on my high output eights than i am with my nines, nines. oh yeah you will it's you will the same size as the six i don't know why they made the six the six doesn't make any sense. i know it That's doesn't I won't buy one don't buy one and you know for 169 they want a, a, a two-pack they want i think 179 right no by far eights are the best batteries you can get you can get an eight and a 12, 12. for 179 we yeah, did the well, deal bought, or 149 wasn't it three eights three twelves and it came out to like five and change really yeah. oh wow hey I want to show people 
I just want to show them that drill with this on it. Mm -hmm. Guys, you know, when, when, I, when I talk about this battery, and the only reason I know it is because I have the six, and obviously I've seen the eight here, and when I noticed that the eight and the six was exactly the same size, and same weight. Yeah. So what they're doing, obviously, is just higher capacity cells. I mean, it's not that big on no, there, guys. It's not. And it doesn't protrude. I like that it doesn't protrude too much out from the front of the. Yep. Yep. And this is a pretty compact. Yeah, that's uh, a small screw gun to begin with. Yep. And look at that, guys. I mean, not really that big on there. I mean, it's something that obviously you don't want to do. Hold that. You don't want well, to do overhead work it, with it. Exactly, but if you need the runtime, if you're doing screwing into the floor or something, decking, that's oh the yeah. You want to go well, with. and and you're getting the extra power from it, right. which is great. But you know, like I said, guys, the the twelve, you just forget it. You're not going to be doing it. Obviously, it'll go on here, but it, it, it's the 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 twelve is such a, there's such a bigger size difference, guys. You have a twelve? Yes. Three. Yeah. All right. I want to show him that just to. Yeah, I'll show you also. Yeah, he'll show it with the battery, and you'll see. I'm going to get that video done, guys, maybe tomorrow night. I, I've been getting a lot of comments about wanting to see it here. Hey, go ahead. Just to finish, just to finish up, I just want yeah. to give the guys an idea of how much stuff you can Oh, in just three. And you, and you have... Well, okay. I have pretty much... You have that basic three. I mean, you have almost oh, every wow. Milwaukee tool you could think of in there. In there, I know. Yeah, I mean, like, this is literally... I have a skill saw, I have a sawzall, I have a hammer drill. Angle a grinder, screw gun. Oh my God, guys! This is when I this is what I tell you guys that I mean, a lot it's of a mobile game box. it's a it is. That's why I tell people so much about this box, guys, because you don't understand even how much you can get in this box. And the thing with this box is obviously you're gonna have to wheel it, right? If you're gonna fill this thing up, this thing is gonna weigh a lot. <laughs> you know, it's gonna be heavy. It's something you don't kind of wanna. So obviously it's wheeled. But if you want kind of that mobile box, we kind of just you got the big handle on this box. I think this is still 79 bucks on so i think acme still has it for 79 but you can fill it up and you can still kind of you know pick it up and move it around right with this box obviously you know it's not made for that i mean look how much stuff he's got in here and that's when people know that these stack on top of each other yeah yep and this came with one right two. this did come with two mm -hmm. no kidding i thought mine Wow, you, you might have got lucky here. I don't think these come in. Oh, maybe, maybe they so. do. <laughs> maybe somebody accidentally threw one in. I guess. And you got this uh, international, right? Yeah. yeah. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I got them such a long time ago. But, yeah, I mean, you guys, look how many. I mean, obviously, he could fill this up with hand tools, right? Maybe he'll only have one of these little uh, containers in here, all right? But you're still going to get a lot of stuff in here. But that is absolutely amazing. I mean, almost everything that you kind of use. Everything, everything that you kind of own. Everything I own. Is, is really in these pack out like boxes. For a DIY guy, that's pretty much your whole setup. You yep. don't really need anything else other than a pack out. That's it. That's it, guys. And Tony does a lot of mace, uh, a lot of drywall, drywall sheetrock. You build schools. So. You're, you're in a union, right? Yeah. yeah. He builds schools. How do you like this? This, this looks pretty new. I actually just got it. You just got it, huh? <laughs> I was going to say, that thing looks damn yeah, good. Yeah, this is my money maker, the drywall gun. That's my it, money. Oh, maker. you like that? Yeah. See, I. And you would love the, the Makita. I have it. You I have it? I had every single one you could think of. This I, is your favorite? That's my favorite. You like this better than the Makita? The Hilti is the best. Uh, Makita yeah. is actually pretty good. I'm not going to lie. Um, just the, the one thing that I do like about this better than the Makita. Right. And if you, it's, it's from a perspective, if you use it all day long. Right. This prevents any type of wobble because it actually covers the shaft of it oh you so know the, what I'm saying? with the makita it's not as deep no it's not deep at all it's actually just like almost an impact okay. you know so well they make three different kinds yes. you know that right yeah they make a high torque they make yep. a torque adjustable one and this has been out a long time i'm, yeah. I'm surprised they haven't updated gen this too. i would love a gen 2 yeah yeah I mean, I know, man you this thing is beat the hell up oh you got the mid torque what do you got? Oh, you got the old. Oh, you don't want to break that new. Is this? Sorry, don't I like this. I, I really want you that. Know what? It's got the USB. Yeah, it's, it's got the USB. We'll put it back. You got that for free, right? That came with one of those kits. Yes. I, yeah. Check out this light, guys. We, uh, again, it's bright. And you got that nice little hook on it. And then it does 360. It does complete 360. And if you want to charge your phone. USB inside of it. Two hooks if you want to use it. I mean, that's pretty much. That's a great little light, man, for free anyway. Right. You know? You hang that up, man. That's awesome, dude. Yeah. So this is what the Gen One, right? Or this is Gen Two? That's search. 
Oh, this is the surge. That's the surge. Wow, you know what? I didn't. Even, wow, look at this freaking thing. Yeah, it's been, those are my money makers. Those are the ones. The surge and the drywall guy. Yeah. And then this little hacksaw. Yeah, I should have known from. Because I am like, man, this thing. This thing looked like. I thought this was it a brushless. Like a, yeah, I know. I thought this was the old brushless for a second. Yeah, it, it, Guys, it, check out this surge. This it, is. Cool. It must have put oh, in man. probably hundreds of thousands of screws. So just that's a testament. Like a lot of people. Hundreds of thousands, I mean, honestly, geez. yeah. See that, guys? For three years I've been using it. And still runs like a champ. Like a champ. Hasn't lost any power. How long have you had it? Not even five years yet, so it's still covered. Because I don't three, think it's been out. Three years, I think I had that. He's had this for three years, guys. And he's still got two years on the warranty. Mm -hmm. All right? That's, you know, we talk a lot about the rigid LSA and stuff like that, guys. You know, it's a great DIY warranty. Don't get me wrong. But, um, you know, for the guys that are using these every day... You know, to have that five year. You know, you're gonna have your tool for five years, um, no matter what you kind of do to it, right? Now, obviously, if he dropped this off a roof or something, you're gonna have, or, or, or if you get them wet. It's fell off a baker. Two, two. Oh yeah, two story. Two sections, yeah, two sections high. It's fell off. Let me. You got a battery. I tell you what, and, and I tell you, like I said, this is my yeah. my this is my favorite. You, see, we'll you know, the 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 12 volt came out, and a lot of people. Are, this and especially the price of this now i'm surprised oh yeah 12 put that sucker on here yeah and this is guys this is a great this is what we actually wanted to do oh no i gotta take the clip off. oh you see you can't even get that one on with yeah, the 12 the clip hits it yep yep yeah, maybe if, if you got the new one they've kind of traded um they've done something with the clips now they if you've noticed them out, they extended them out but again guys look at this thing <laughs> like this is something you're not gonna you're not gonna use right obviously yeah you could Show them. I mean, look, look at this thing. Obviously, it still works great. I'll tell you, I think it's a little bit louder, though. <laughs> yeah, I mean. Yeah. Okay. That's awesome, dude. Well, I don't know about your warranty. You might have to have your receipt now because you don't have nothing There's left no on here. There's no serial numbers on that. I that mean, is crazy. No, nah, they'll hook you up. Yeah, I had no. $119. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. Buy a new one. You can get it. But, guys, look at that. So. This was the, the, my my point. Now, where's um, the eight? You still have that? The eight with the uh, impact? Yeah. The, the brush? The brushless? Oh, Thank you. Wow, you got a lot of batteries, man. Holy crap. He's got one over here on the... Uh, he's using the old three on uh, the blower here. So that's what I want to see them come out with, too. Yeah, I think you brought it with you. Oh, it's right there. Right next to you. Oh, it's on the ground. Right there. Oh, here it is, guys. All right, so look. And you got to remember, the surge is actually well. I'll tell you, people don't know how compact this it's is. It's ridiculously compact. It's surge, almost subcompact that one. Yep, that's a nine to give you a comparison. Yep, a little bit bigger. All right, um, our brushless eighteen volt again, non fuel, just a brushless ninety nine bucks. Actually, eighty nine. I got a picture. Now I don't know if that's going to happen everywhere, but you know, you can see by a Swedish. Blah, I don't want to say it. We got kids. But there is, I mean, look at the difference, guys. All right, this is just like, you know, this is a nine. All right? It's a little, it's a little lower than a nine. It's a little bit lower and a little bit wider. Mm -hmm. But that that lower um, si size of it, it just makes it a more, you know, comfortable, mm -hmm. um, you know, tool to use or, or battery to use on your tool. But... I just want you to get that. Look, look at that. This almost looks like a five amp hour battery on here. You know what I'm saying? I mean, look at the height difference. And remember how the surge is smaller than the um, the brushless. All right. Yeah. I mean, guys, it's actually the eight is lower. Mm -hmm. All right. The eight is lower. All right, or just about the same size. Now, obviously, like I said, these are 21,700 cells, so it's a little bit wider. But not to get too down to the thing here, my, my whole point with this, guys, is the 8 is the 6-amp-hour high-output battery, all right? And I think the versatility of it, where you can put it on really any tool, any outdoor power equipment tool, and get that extra runtime, you get the 21,700 cells, I think it's the best battery out there, all right? I have a feeling we're going to see the end of these, these nines. Now, when I talk to Milwaukee, they include this 9-amp-hour battery in a lot of sets, right? What else does this 9 come with? I'm trying to think. comes with the miner saw. 
It comes with the backpack vac. A lot of the outdoor power equipment. Yep, and all the out. They, they designed this battery really for the out OPE platforms. All right, uh, that's kind of what I was told back in the day. Really designed for the OPE stuff. All right. Now, obviously, with the invention here of these twenty one seven hundred cells, and especially in OPE tools. You get more of a pop. Right. Right. Now, not like with a chainsaw. Mm -hmm. The high output would be that that that's huge. Blower too. With the blower, with a string trimmer, not that big of a deal. Um, you know, you'll notice it with the blower. It just sounds different. It, it sounds different. It sounds it's, different. It's, uh, tremendously lighter than the nine. And as it's well. yep. You know, there's a there's a big weight difference between the two. Actually, weight. I I would probably say this is heavier. You think so? Yeah, only because of the cells. They're, you know, if you ever seen a 21700, no, they're huge. They may weigh more, but... Yeah, this, oh, the size difference yeah. is what does it. They're just about the same weight-wise. This one might be a little bit heavier, all right? Because I, I think I, met, I I weighed the 6 to this in a mm -hmm. video, and the 6 high output was actually heavier than the 9. But, you know, the 9 isn't heavy. It's just big, you know? it's This isn't a heavy... And this is a great battery, guys. So for the guys that have this, I mean, I have the old school ones that are all gray. Mm -hmm. So this one's a newer one. But, you know, it's, again, it's, it's you know, a 5 amp hour battery. And this one, it, it's not that big of a difference, guys. Right? Not that big. So, you know, the, the, the problem with it is not the weight. And that's what I meant to kind of show you. The actual size is the difference. All right? So the height, right? So that's what makes the eight a great little battery. Can you take this eight off? And this is like a comparison of all three here. So I kind of, you see that? And this is actually a better one. And that's the 12. All right, so 12, nine, five, eight. All right, and then when you come this way, all right? I mean, this is, it's a little bit, it, this is a little bit higher than the five, but I'm telling you, um, size-wise, the eight, I think, is the best battery. All right. Um, I mean, like I said, we're talking centimeters. All right. Maybe, maybe, I don't know, two tenths, two twelfths. What's it in? 16? 16? Mm -hmm. uh, less than a quarter inch difference. All right. In, in height than a regular five. Again, the big difference is this. Because remember, this is uh, this is two rows of 21700s. This is two rows of 18650s. All right? So that's the, you know, that this is, people don't understand how big these 21700 cell batteries are. All right? They're, they're, they're wider, right? That's the size, 21700 and 18650. All right? So great, great video, Tony. That's awesome. Now we got to put this all back. But what a genius idea with that! Mm -hmm. All you're doing is notching a little. Measure it. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you probably still remember the what was it like, uh, two inches, an inch and a half um, with the multi tool. Yeah, pretty much just the width of whatever yeah, blade I have. Yeah, that notch. Just just measure if you have a low profile, guys. I don't know, two two and a half inches tops. You cut it right out with your multi tool. That I'm sure a lot of you guys got that Milwaukee multi tool for 99 bucks, and that's it. it. It clips right in naturally. You wonder if they kind of design that maybe to do something like that. It's weird that it does have that. Because I still don't even know what the heck. You know, they were telling us that one year that this, you know, Wi-Fi signal here, and we still have no idea what this is for. But there's some type of intelligence in this uh, battery. You know. Um, Bluetooth, I don't, I don't know what the hell it is, to be honest with you. Obviously, we know the Rigid um, has Bluetooth and, and stuff like that, but it's got some type of, uh, what year is this one? Oh, yeah, where's that one battery? That three, <laughs> that thing right there. <laughs> what the hell happened to this thing? That was one of the old school ones. Wow, and it still works. still works. Still works. Look I mean, at this thing. That's got to be over probably six maybe even more years old. Six years old. Yeah. You know, people don't understand how great Milwaukee batteries are. And, you know, we did that video. I don't know if you were still, oh, if you were watching me at that time, Tony, but I had all my nines and I used my nines every day for my OPE stuff. And I, we got up to a hundred charges and then I stopped. 
Um, but again, this thing probably has over a thousand charges. I mean, it's got a lot. It's been if you charge this every day for six years, five days a week, you think about it, how many times um, this thing has been charged. I mean, even if you look at the button is almost worn out. Oh, yeah. But it's still holding a charge. It's, and it's it still, still works. Yeah, it's still, <laughs> still kicking. <laughs> and you can probably tell what year this is from still. Yep, yeah, you can. Yeah, this one is... Unless they didn't do them that way back then. I, I don't know. They might have... Actually, I think on these... Well, this one says 012. Yeah, 012. See, they, they had it right here. That's right. I kind of messed up. 2014. Mm -hmm. Yep. I'm sorry. Yeah, so guys... So four years, I'm sorry. No, it's it's, no, it's, it's, five. it's five. Almost six. Yep, so I, I, I looked in the wrong spot on this. But the new... The new batteries, it's it's right up here. That's why I was like, "What?" I don't even think I don't I don't know if the M18 platform was even out in 06. That was 13 years ago. But anyway, five years, guys, with the three amp hour. You don't have any of the compact threes? I do. They're you do. Far. Okay, man, you must have 30 batteries uh, at least. <laughs> at least. But that's great, and you know, guys, again, he's got his circular, his super sawzall. All right, right off the bat, the two biggest most commonly used tools in this box guys and it's like all right now i'm gonna put my hammer drill my lights my screw gun my mid torque impact my angle grinder my sds my surge they're just flying in here folks absolutely crazy guys and that is awesome i mean look at that look at that organ just and you still can put stuff in there oh yeah you can fit another two tools maybe you, uh, easy that is crazy, guys. Great video, guys. I hope you guys got enjoyed it. Got some good stuff out of this. Thank you, Tony. He's the man. All right, guys. I'll catch you.